Hey guys, welcome back to Yo-Kai Watch 2, and today we're going to be going after some exclusive event Yo-Kai. Now, these Yo-Kai cannot be obtained in Yo-Kai Watch 2 without first scanning a special QR code. And luckily for all of you, I have access to these QR codes. So to scan these codes, all you gotta do is come to this lovely receptionist here in Uptown Springdale's Pickleston Bank. And I guess we should start first with, um, hmm, yeah, let's go with them. Let's start first with the Fruit and Yon. Scan this code for Watermelon Yon. This code will give you Kiwin Yon. This code will give you Melon Yon. And this one will give you Oran Yon. Use this metal code to get Strawbin Yon. And last but not least, scanning this QR code will give you the item to get Grape Yon. Which has to be one of the coolest, but we're not done yet. Believe it or not, there's still two more event yokai that Currently haven't been released, but we have the QR codes for. Scan this QR code to get access to the Jet Bell, which will give you Jet Nyan. And last but not least, my least favorite of all of these yokai. And if you scan this QR code, you will get access to the Wanderer's Bell, which will give you Wonder Nyan. Well, you gotta go find them after all. No, it's gonna be such a pain to get that one, but. Yes, at any point in the game, as long as you can access the areas in which these yokai appear in, you can battle them. And come to think of it, let's start with the easiest one first and head to Springdale Elementary to search for Jetnyan. To get Jetnyan, all you gotta do is come up to the top of your school. And once you scan the QR code, a special yokai will be waiting for you. Hey, Jetnyan, what's up? I zoomed here at top speed. Well, I feel pretty meh. <laughs> what? Hey you, you wanna battle with me? And give me the push I need? Then I feel like flying again. You win. Uh, sure, I guess we got nothing to lose, Jet and Yon, and thank you. Let's not waste any time in here. <laughs> this has to be one of the weirdest forms of Jabon Yon, but yes. I guess Jet and Yon is a thing now, and he, like all the other Nyons, loves Choco Bars. So we're gonna do our best to try and recruit this yokai, because, I mean, come on! You know me, I wanna get all the Jabon Yons, but here's the thing. My current team is pretty darn strong, so finding yokai to actually, like, help in befriending him was a pretty difficult task, and no, Wobble Walk, don't be afraid, it's just Jet and Yon, oh my gosh, okay. So here's the deal with these specific yokai. Getting them can prove to be a very difficult task, since there is no four-star Choco Bar, and okay, there we go. It's a guaranteed Inspirement. Boom. Okay, let's find that heart. Oh, man. We're actually running a little low on time. Come on, where is it? Oh, man, we couldn't find it. No, we knocked out Jet Nyan. Oh, well. What are you gonna do? I guess I'll just have to get him at the end of this episode, but yeah. Jet Nyan's pretty cool yokai. Not sure why he has a jet on his head, but I assume it's like a tie-in with some airline in Japan. I don't really know. And that battle's got me flying high. I feel so strong. We could take to the skies right now. But I've never left the ground before. <laughs> what? This airplane's just a model after all. <laughs> Leave me alone for a while to think about all this. Nyan, I might change my mind about the whole flying thing. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, that's the dialogue when we don't recruit Jet and Yon. Don't worry, we'll be back for him maybe at the end of this episode. But now, on to the next yokai that we can obtain. And these ones are actually kind of far away, so just to remind you, these yokai cannot appear unless you have these specific key items. You need the melon seeds, orange seeds, grape seeds, kiwi seeds, berry seeds, and also the watermelon seeds. Not sure why those are all the way over there, they just are. So make sure you have these key items and then head to the school in Harrisville. Present Harrisville to be exact. And if you've done everything correctly <laughs> inside Harrisville school, there, there, there's gonna be a legion of fruit yokai. What the? Honestly, I don't know why this is a concept, but I stinking love it. And uh, today class, we're gonna learn about the history of the great Jabanyan and how you're all descendants of him. And half the series is just, okay, <laughs> why is half the series ghost anyways? Now, if you want to guarantee the fact that you will recruit these yokai, you just need to save before you talk to them and battle them. From all I can gather, just like Hover Nyan, Dark Nyan, all the other Nyans, it's a once a day chance. 
Like we say before, the game doesn't know. And hey, what's up, Melon Yon? <laughs> Those are melon seeds. You picked out the melon from among all the other fruits. You must have a real eye for quality. But how strong are you? Let's battle and find out together. Uh, okay, we'll start with you, I guess. And that's the spirit. Let's see how you handle my high quality melon juice. I just imagine he's juice like melon juice out of every orifice of his skin and fills the entire room, but no, that'll be way too much money for level 5 to produce. Anyways, yet again, they all like Choco Bars, and if you don't have Choco Bars, all you gotta do is go to Blossom Heights and talk to the candy lady, and this is it. <laughs> Why would a melon like Choco Bars? Is anyone else bothered by that? Just me? Alright, whatever. Get in there, Wubble Walk. Hopefully this time we can find the heart. Yep, found it. Nope, that's not the heart. Where is it? Come on! Yeah, we got it. Okay, sweet. So, now currently we have almost the highest chance to recruit Melanyon. But the issue is, I still don't think we're going to get him because... Yeah! Getting these yokai is pretty darn rare. And I didn't say beforehand, so this is actually going to take me two days. But, oh well, eventually at the end we'll show them all off. And, bummer. Eh, <laughs> Nyan. You really took the juice out of me. My performance back there was utterly flavorless. Come back after I've had a chance to ripen up. <laughs> All right, man, these fruit puns. Hey, Oranyon. Those are orange seeds. So you like oranges, huh? Hmm, you must really know your stuff. Looks like I could use some vitamin C. Want a battle? What do you say? Well, I wouldn't have brought these seeds to you if that wasn't the case. And okay, let's do this, Nyan. <laughs> I love these guys so much. It's just the most ridiculous concept ever. I understand a lot of people don't like the concept of having multiple Jabanyan forms of essentially the same mascot over and over again, but I stinking love it, man. And Aranya, I this character is such a troll. Lots of vitamin C. I like it. You know, it's unique. What franchise is just so silly enough that it would make this many versions? Of its mascot. I don't know about you. I also can't find the heart. This is really annoying me. Oh my gosh. All right. At least we can poke it again and it purify. Oh, found it on the first try. Come on, a little bit more. Oh, we knocked him out too fit. Man, poor Ornyan. Now, these yokai are a little bit special than other yokai. So, that <laughs> makes it sound like, oh yeah, what makes them so special? Oh, we didn't get another one. Come on. Gosh, and yeah. Am I vitamin C deficient? I'll be ready for you next time. Uh, yeah, yeah. So, basically, to recruit these specific yokai in Japan, you would need their QR code, which can be obtained from their medals in respective yokai watch, you know, packs and just medals. And I think some of these were actually promotional, like magazine only exclusive yokai, which is kind of hard for you to get them. But since the QR code data is the same in Japan and in English, we can just battle them without even needing their medal. And, are those kiwi seeds? Ooh, people who love kiwis are people who I love. I'm a kiwi lover. Lover. <laughs> I'm all ripe and ran for some battle. So how about it? You want to battle with me? We'll have some fun. Oh man, kiwi on is really serious and that's the spirit. All right then, let's go. The amount of characters in this game that say that's the spirit is almost staggering at times. And okay, kiwi Nyan, you're going to help me out or are you going to make are you going to make this difficult? Oh, you're gonna make it easy for me. Only one way to find out. Mm, yum meow. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, Kiwi Nyan does some damage. But how much damage will you do when you have no stats? <laughs> All right. Come on, where are you? Oh, it's definitely there. Kiwi Nyan's voice is very different than how I thought. I mean, I did. Is it a girl too? I guess it is. But yeah, let's wrap this up. We got the food. We got the experiment going. Chances are. Oh my gosh, guys, stop buffing yourself. She has one HP. There we go. And it's also a good point to note. These are not Jubanyan, who just got a hold of some ripe fruits. It is, in fact, a completely different entity in the Yokai Watch universe. I know this because they have really funny scenes in the anime. They go to a school, I guess. And wow, you don't mess around, do you? Let's do this again. After I'm ripe and ready to go for. <laughs> God dang it. <laughs> oh man, are we going to get any of them? And. Watermelon yawn! What's well, in summertime? Watermelon's just a thing. If you got all this watermelon seeds, you must love summer. So you want to battle me and get the full summer experience? Uh, sure, but aren't you endangered when it's summertime? And let's go! The battle of summer begin! <laughs> watermelon yawn has to be the biggest, like, 
mouthful. I, I, I can't believe they actually had enough characters to fit him into Yokai Watch 2, but yeah, same fight as before. And I like it how we take all of them outside. I, I don't know why that's so funny to me, but. Are we going to get a single Yokai in this episode on the first try? If so, I would love that. And man, Watermelon, yeah, it's so hard to say his name. You know, shout out to the voice actor doing this guy, man. I'm just saying. Come on, give me the heart. Can't. Oh, found it. It's on the right ear. No, Wibble Wobble. Ugh, wobble Walk. Maybe I should bring in, like, weaker Yokai to do this, man, because we're just. We're not even getting to the experiment. Yeah, I think that's definitely the way to go, but hey, at least they're pretty good experience. And ooh, a broken bell. So that means you can actually get tough bells and speed bells from these guys. And what? Are you trying to crack me open? I may have a tough exterior, but inside, I'm soft and sweet. Aw, Yon, I need you to my head to rest. All right. Well, thanks, Watermelon Yon. And hey, what's up? What's this now? You mocking me? That's the last straw. <laughs> straw <Strawman. laughs> Wait, are those strawberry seeds? You got that? <gasps> Why don't you say so? You have the fiber required to take me off. <laughs> if not, I'll hook you up anyway. <laughs> All right, let's go, Strawbignon. I thought you'd go for it. Let's go. Hands down, my favorite fruit out of all those they sell. You know, honestly, why isn't there, why isn't there banana yon? Well, my gosh, that'd be the hardest thing to say in the world. Oh my goodness! Could you imagine the level five localization team actually fitting banyan? Wait, wouldn't it be banyan? Man, I'm so stupid. Oh my goodness! But whoa, Strawbignon is really tanky. Holy crud! Hoverignon doesn't even have bad spirit. Oh my gosh, is Strawbignon invincible? No. No yokai is invincible. As we've proven multiple times, we're pretty much undefeated in this game now that Cat Cradle has been destroyed. Or technically, I guess it isn't since it reset time and all that stuff, but yeah. Since we fed it and we knocked it to Oh! Oh, we got a broken bell though. That's really good luck. Man, I'm okay with that. We could uh put um Raw Banyan in there, but it, it doesn't really matter. Strawbignon goes down. Could you please join me? Just to make my life a little bit easier. Come on, Strawbignon, please! I'm begging you. Come on. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this, man. Aw, oh, that was tart starting. <laughs> Good thing I savor challenging battles. I don't know how many more food puns I can say. Anyways, Grape and Yon, let's go and. Hey, what's the word on the vine, eh? Wait, those are grape seeds. Huh, so you came seeking my scent. Well, are you gonna battle me? So you can get some more of that scent? Do grapes smell nice? I... I guess? Yeah, let's go and... Yaha! So you can hardly contain your love of my scent. I guess there's only one thing left to do. Let's get this battle start. Grape and yon, no one gives a crud about your scent. But join me, okay? <laughs> Alright, so... Yet again, yeah, getting these guys is pretty straightforward. I don't know... Oh, it's a water attribute, Yokai. Hey, at least that's something cool. So we're gonna turn the uh, speed up off. Uh, wait, are we going to get the heart or not? Nope, it's definitely there. Oh, we got it. First try. Heck yeah. Okay. And wow, the battle's already over. Wow, Grape and Yon, definitely not the strongest of them all. I think they're actually different ranks too. And oh my god, we didn't get a single one. Are you joking? Ugh, that was Grape. You can come back anytime, Yan. None of these six yokai joined me. Are you kidding? Oh my gosh. All right. I'll get those tomorrow by save scumming. Now on to the last event yokai and yokai watch 2 that we can currently obtain, which is Mount Middleton. And if you have the Wanderer's Bell, come to Cicada Canyon in Mount Middleton in present Harrisville. And if you look over to the right, there's a purple wisp that wasn't there before. What's all that about, you may be wondering? Well, it's the last event yokai that we can currently get in the game. Who's quite the wonder. Hi there, and I am Wonder Nyan. Nice to meet you. I've been around this great big world, Nyan, but I always come back here. I just love the challenge of battling yokai. I think I'll stick around for a while this time and just hone my skills, Nyan. Speaking of, are you looking for a tussle? Nyan, come on, it'll be fun. Uh, yeah, why not? I battled all your other brethren and I like it. Nyan, let's go. 
Nyan. Oh my gosh, that's so <laughs> Anyways, this is Wonder Nyan, which no is not a pirate themed yokai at all. In fact, he's actually used as promotional material for Level 5's other game, or I shouldn't say other game, they have a lot of games for crying out loud, which is Wonder Flick, which is a mobile, like, treasure gathering RPG, and yeah, I don't know, I think it's kind of cool. But the game apparently isn't really that good from what I have gathered around the internet, so... I'm not sure if he's gonna be people's favorite yokai, but you know what? That's fine, he doesn't have to be, and... There we go. Yeah. Yet again, he's uh, kind of lackluster until we can recruit him. And are we gonna get him on our team? Come on, come on, please. Just one out of like literally the... Oh my gosh, we've got him! Heck yeah! Wonder Nyan approaches. You have a wonderful power. If it's okay, I want to travel with you. Nyan. Oh my gosh, what? I literally interjected that one. He didn't even say it, but yes. Please join my team. Wonder Nyan! Wonder! <laughs> Wingy just sounds so goofy. Oh my gosh, I love the voice actress for Jabanya, and we got Captain Nyando Corsair. Huh. Guess that one's pretty cool. And Doubloon. So a lot of pirate-themed ones, it seems. Not bad. Glad to have you, Wonder Nyan, but he is but one of the many Nyans we still must recruit. So yeah, this episode technically isn't over until I get them all, and uh, you got me this time, Nyan. But next time, my sword will be at the ready. Nyan, I'll be quick and cunning. I'll have my chance at revenge yet. All right, yeah, good luck with that when my, my team of six yokai. I don't think a lot of people in-game realize I have six yokai, and you're one yokai. <laughs> Anyways, since I said this episode isn't over yet, I'm going to cut in the future and show you Jet Nyan, Kiwin Nyan, Grip, you get, you get the deal. Show off all their stats, all their ultimates, and all of their medallion entries. So see you guys in a bit. This is going to take me all day. Holy crud. Oh my gosh, thank you. <laughs> he finally joined and if I'm with you, it's like I could soar through the sky. Take me with you. Uh, sure thing, man. Ready for takeoff! Hmm, sounds pretty darn cool. N nothing like I made him sound like, but yes, after trying to get Jetnyan for about like 20 minutes actually, he finally decided to join me. Now on to the Fruit Nyan. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. <laughs> Watermelon Yan joins and ouch! I thought I was gonna be smashed. You wanna be my friend? Yeah, man, let's do it. Watermelon. So, summertime. So, summertime. <laughs> Man, I love these guys so much. But yes, Watermelon is an A rank yokai. And as a result, it might take you a little while to get. You know, it took me a long time. Oh, thank goodness. All right. <laughs> I literally only took three tries, and it's sweet and sour feeling, Yan. I want to get along with you. All right. Well, heck yeah. Join my team. Strabignon. What? Strabignon doesn't have additional dialogue like all the other ones? That's kind of lame. Oh, well, I'm so happy to have her. <laughs> Heck yeah, now only four more to go. Oh my goodness, thank you. I'm so tired of doing this, guys. I, uh, I want to be friends with me and my fresh pick self. Yes, join team now. Grape Nyan. So fresh. So fresh! I, I wonder if that's actually a different voice actress. Sounds radically different than Al or the girl that does Jaban Yan. But yay! We got Graham Yan! Oh my goodness, thank you. Thank you, this one took so long, you guys have no idea. You have a discerning eye, let's be friends. Okay. Melon Yan! So expensive. And so difficult to recruit. Oh my gosh, I've been trying to get this yokai for more than an hour. This one is so hard to get. My goodness, dude. <sighs> oh my gosh, I'm finally done. I'm finally done. It's Ornyan! You're strong, yeah? Let's be friends. Ornyan! Yeah. Ornyan! 
so juicy. Juicy. And wait, I don't think I'm done yet. Oh my gosh, I still have Kiwanyan. Oh my goodness. All right. Oh my gosh, you have no idea how long this took, guys. I'm just being real with you. And I can't believe I lost when I'm so ripe. It's frustrating. So at least be my friend. Yes. Kiwanyan. That's all you have to say? After all that, all of Derek, multiple hours of trying to get all of you. Okay, Kiwan Yan, you know what? Whatever. Thanks for joining me. <laughs> I guess. Gosh. And all right, guys, I finally have done it. That look, that took actually like three hours to do of just nonstop Choco Bar feeding, but we got them all. And now I'll show you their individual stats and what they can do in battle. So first up, we got Wonder Nyan, the only yokai I got from just battling them. His stats are not the best. At all, actually. Defense being her lowest stat, not really super great, even though I use Hover Nyan all the time and he has literally the same thing. But, Wonder Nyan, he's not bad. He attacks multiple times with his physical attack, just like Shogun Nyan, and there's actually a lot of similarities between those two, but all around, he looks like a pretty cool yokai. Here's individual abilities. His ultimate attack is called Vagabond Blade, and he has Wonderlust. The inspirited yokai's adventurous spirit rises with its strength. Yeah, and that'll last a pretty long time, and he's also an absorption technique. That's a very, very peculiar. Up next, we have a Kiwinyan, and all of the Fruitinyan, by the way, have the same exact skill. When they get knocked out in battle, they fill up their ally's soul meter. Not the best, not the worst, but since he's a rare yokai, he's going to get better stats per level. His stat spread, a little bit better. Having a spirit low definitely does help, but Stubble Barrier and Fur Coat greatly boosts an ally's defense with Kiwi Fuzz. Oh, I love that. Up next, Ornyan heals all allies with a burst of vitamin C. Greatly boosts strength with pure vitamin C strength. Melanyan has a melon juice, gradually heals allies. Pretty good in Melon Masher. <laughs> this looks like Master. Grape Buddies is Grape Nyan's Sultimate and, and Feeling Grape. Delicious grape juice greatly boosts spirit. Strawberry Roar and Straw Burst. Sweet. <laughs> so silly, man. I love these guys so much. And I just realized, you see all of them, we kind of need to go in the Medallion Hall. Huh? Let's sort by tribe. I think that'd be a little bit on the smarter side. So let's check out the uh, other ones we don't have on our watch at the moment. Watermelon Yan. Pretty cool yokai. Watermelon. <laughs> Watermelon juice boosts strength. Not bad, and I think, yeah, Jetnyan is the only one that we don't have our own watch at the moment. So, Paws of Flying, not Fury. Attack all enemies with Paws powered by Jumbo Jet Engines. Man, that sounds devastating, and Jet Propulsion. Basically just a boost of speed. Now, there is a slight error on his skill. It's F Pelican is number one, but it's just supposed to be the ability number one. I'm not sure if in a future update they're going to change this or not, but I sure hope so. And basically, if Jitnyan is front and center, he gets a boost in speed. Pretty darn strong, actually, all things considered. But yeah, now let's check out their medallion entries, which I think is the best part, because a lot of these guys have some really funny ones, so let's check them out. And they're actually in the back. Not too sure why that is. I guess it's just like event yokai in general or always in the back, but starting off with Melanyan, a juicy yokai who's been known to fetch a high price. He thinks less of other fruit as a result. Melanyan, that's so mean of you. Come on. And yeah, I'm not going to show the animations off because they're all identical and more orange than cat. This yokai would rather sleep in a bowl than knock it off the table. I love how this game actually acknowledges how real cats act. I'm tired of this idea that cats do not destroy things out of random hatred. It's the truth, everybody. Anyways, this Kiwi Kitty combo has a charming furry coat that can soften the blows of attacking foes. Grape and Yon's aroma drives the ladies crazy. And boy, does this narcissist know it. Oh my god. It's so funny. <laughs> this yokai knows there's no honor greater than being placed on top of shortcake. You know what? Same. I agree with that. And this juicy yokai lives in the fear of being sliced up and served for dessert on a hot summer's day. Oh my gosh. Let's check out Wonder Nyan's 
never without his bandana and sword. This wandering Jabanyan has visited many distant lands. Huh, interesting. And Jitnyan's dream of soaring through the skies. But that model plan on his head isn't going to help. So it's just literally a model on his head. And I was actually wrong. This yokai appears in a yokai watch movie, which is why he has the jet on his head. I'm not sure if it's like a tie-in with an airline or not, but I think that'd be pretty cool. One last thing though, let's actually check out some of their medals, since the metal artwork is actually in the game, which is an aspect I think is just so stinking cool. So let's start off with Melanion. Ooh, he's surrounded by melons. Look at him, he's so cocky. He's like, <laughs> I'm the most expensive. Ornion, mm, not, not as... You know, he's just happy to be here and happy to help out with vitamin C. Kiwanyan, it looks like they all have the exact same background, which is actually sort of cool. Looking pretty darn cute. Yeah, oh, look at him, he's so He's just like, ah, the aroma of grapes, truly the greatest of times. Strabanyan, looking pretty dapper, even though I think that one's actually a girl, but... Melanyan, on the other hand, ferocious, angry even. Let my melon brethren go! He screeches into the night. Anyways, Wonder Nyan. Oh wow, his metal looks so cool. I kind of want that one now, man. Not bad. Um, and last but not least, Jet Nyan, who <laughs> he's trying to fly. Oh my gosh, I love that so much. But that is all the time I have for today. But the showcase of these yokai is not over yet. Tune in till the end to see their sultiments in action. They're actually pretty darn cool. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video, and see you guys in the next one, where we take on the dreaded Oni. So see you guys then. Bye.